Hey guys, Damners here. I want to say Merry Christmas to all the Damners fans. And today I'll be showing you all the gifts I got. And if you're wondering who's that, that's my kitty. Hi, kitty. Oh, you've been a cute kitty, kitty. Oh, good girl. Anyways, let's have a look at the things I got here first. So, number one thing I'm gonna first. I also got is a the a pedestrian signal instructions button in instructions. As you can see, you can see the walk phase, start crossing, and watch your vehicles, and the don't start crossing if started, time remaining. This is for a time remaining pedestrian signal. And a don't cross study, and you just push the button across, it will take me to this way. Looks really nice. Um, you can find these on streets and roads if you live in the U.S. Um, yeah, not bad. I love it. It's one of my favorites. Let's just put it to the side. To my one of my fire alarms I have. Now let's move on to the next magnet thing I got. The next gift I also got is a railroad sign. These things can be found near railroad crossings and all this stuff. So you can see this one's made out of, I think it's out of the middle too. I don't know. These things can break easily, just like my pedestrian sign. Um, so when you get close to a railroad crossing, this warning sign will head up like under GPS and some stuff. This warning message, this railroad crossing sign, it's actually a warning message on my Garmin GPS. I just don't know where it is right now, so if I have found it, I'll make another video about it. Still having issues, but, yeah. Hi, kitty. You like my room, huh? Huh? Yeah, she's trying to leave. She's just checking out my stuff I got. Anyways, if you like this, let me know. This looks like a nice gift. I, find. I can find something with it. Oh. Cat. Um, if you find anything with this, just let me know. If you let me know where I can put it, and yeah, thanks. And let's put this studly down, and let's move on to one of the signs I got. So the next gift is one of my most favorite ones so far. So right here, this is a walk symbol from Canada. Hi, kitty, you're in the way. Try. I don't want to see you. I want to see the sign, kitty. Oh, you want to block the tail on the camera? Wow. Great. Like I was just saying, um, this is one of my most favorite gifts I got so far. This is Canada's walk symbol pedestrian sign. I like how it looks. The differences of my GE pedestrian signal that's right here. Um, one notice about it is the head looks different and the arms look different. His, his feet is like little split off apart so like if I did turn on the GE let me go do that real quick sorry kitty you might be in the way I just turn on the GE it's walk sign there we go yes kitty yes I see you I see you. Let's go hide in there. I'll be done in a sec, Kitty. I'll be, I'll be fast. Sorry about that, guys. Like if I was saying, the only difference is that this one. Oh, hi, Kitty, Kitty. I know you love me. I know. One difference is that this one and that one is they look just a bit different. You see the differences? I don't know if you can hear me that well because the microphone is blocking it because the microphone is like somewhere around here. It's kind of annoying. So, yeah, you see the differences? Yeah, they look different. And I see you, kitty. I know. I know you want to be in the video real bad. I know. It's okay. How about I let her out to make her happy? You want to be out, kitty? Hold on a sec, guys. All right, guys. I got the cat out. But like I was saying, they look different. Because, <laughs> um, yeah, I really like it. I wish it was like LED. I don't think I might get an LED handed man sometime from Canada from, on eBay, but... <laughs> So you guys can see, I like it, so. So anyways, let's move on. The next gift I got is money! Money, 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 money. Yeah, I love money. Fifty dollars. Yeah, money! Money! 
<laughs> Move that to the side. That's, now, the next gift I also got is in one of my real fanners. are going to love this. It's a Lionel Railroad Crossing gate. As you can see, there's this original box. Lionel. Um, one thing I like about it is I like the double wolf lights in red. See all the red lights? See the gate can go down, can go up. I wonder how I'm going to keep it stay down when the train is coming. So I think it needs to be on train tracks. I'm not really sure. And I like how you can see there's a mechanical bell on top of the, on the crossing. I don't know how well that's going to focus, but... That's because there's a train coming. Ding, 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 ding. Wait for the train to go by. And goes up. Wow, that's nice. I don't know what this metal part is. I think it's from real crossings, I think. So no one can go around the gate. So I can make it go back up. So yeah. Yeah. So yeah, that's pretty much it about this thing. I like how there's a mechanical bell on top. I wish they had like sound. So, yeah. So yeah, I can see the back. So yeah, if you have any questions about my new toy, let me know. I did open up some other gifts on Christmas Eve that I'll show you in here soon. So now let's put this one to the side and let's move on to the next gift I also got. Yeah, I'm Shark Puppet. Yeah. Anyways, this is um the Shark Puppet. Um, if you have never heard of a YouTuber named Shark Puppet, he's really funny. I love his videos. Um, go, I may remind I remind you to go subscribe to his channel. He um um he's a good YouTuber. He's it's funny. He's a Shark Puppet. Yeah. I like cheese. Yeah, he likes cheese. Squishy cheese. Yeah, he, he is. I would like to take them out and test them out, but I think I already have one like this, but I already have, I, I, when I opened up on Christmas Eve, I already got another one. I actually, before Christmas Eve, I opened up this one before, and I was actually, now I have two, so I don't know what I'm going to do with this one. I might keep it, or maybe I can give it away to my one of my classmates when I go back to school, so I am picked out. Um, all right, let me know what should I do with it, because I don't know what to do with it. And let's just move on. Now I got the dinos. I want to live again from the stupid meter. Yep, that's the dino puppets. I got different ones. I got the T Rex. I feel like this is a Segasaurus. I'm not sure. They look nice. Did not this fun as a shark puppet, but they look cool. Very nice. I like the big tongue and the sharp teeth. So I'm gonna go test them out because they've been all boxed. Yeah, I'm the big dinosaur. No meter's gonna get me. <laughs> yep, the meter got him. <laughs> and let's put these ones to the side. Um, carefully. Don't wanna drop it. Let's move on. Now, next, I also got is a new tablet slash PC case. I wanted one so bad because I really need one. This is what it looks like. It looks really nice. See, you can fit the camera on there nice. I think it feels like leather. I'm not really sure. Maybe it's not leather, but so you see, it's for a iPad Pro 11 case, third generation 2020. Does it mean like 2021? Because black. Okay. Um, I think that will still fit. As you can see. Look nice. I will have to open it out, test it out, and see. And it feels nice. So it doesn't block my stupid microphone again. I can't feel stupid when I block my hands on the microphone. 
Yeah, it looks nice. I love it. And I'm going to put it on and see if it works. Alright, guys. Before you start saying, I thought this was a book. But I feel like this is actually a screen protector for an iPad Pro. You can see for an iPad Pro 11 2020 second gen. Wait a minute. Mine's a third gen. I don't think this is going to fit. Well, I can try it out, but I doubt it will fit because mine's a 2021-11 third gen. Because, but if I have, I will have to test it out. If it doesn't fit, then I might need to get a refund because I, I, I have a 2021, not a 2020. Um, I heard a no button. That I forgot to grab one of my gifts that I will show you guys in a sec. Um, and there it is. I like. I have to test it out. Um, I'm kind of confused with this one. So if, I, if it works, I'll let you know. Now, second to last, I have is a, oh, and two older vehicles from the 1940s. One of those in the 1930s. The on top is a 1934 Ford Coupe. Um, I hope I said that right. It looks nice. And that on top, the bottom we have is a 1949 Ford Coupe. As I, I like it. It's from Mortimax. Um, people are asking why I haven't did startups in a while. I am actually, I'm completely sorry I haven't got those out in a while. I'm actually I'm taking a little break from starting up, but I'll make sure to bring one out soon. I'm going to try my best to go out, so... I know I make other content too. I can, I'm not just making startups. I make other content, but I'm going to try to bring them out as soon as I can. So now my feet are starting to itch. So yeah, they look nice. So I guess I'll put them on my shelf. That's where all my other vehicles are. So yeah, and why won't my feet stop itching? You know, let's put them away and move on to my. Last bit of my presents. Well, not really, because I missed some downstairs. Anyways, let's move on. Now, last but not least, for this Christmas Day, I actually got three new of my favorite t-shirts. Um, one right here says, Take him to the train station shirt, which is nice. I even got its Friday shirt because Fridays is my only day. Not Monday, not Tuesday, not Wednesday, not Thursday. Friday. Friday is the only day that I can only wear the shirt. Friday is the only day I can wear the shirt. Yeah, I'll wear the shirt every Friday so I can finally get a celebration. Yeah. Yeah. Take that, school. You don't deserve to be happy. You deserve to be angry. You. Oh, yeah, Friday is my favorite because Friday is my favorite. That's a nice shirt. And last but not least, is another train shirt. It says, I um, mean, I don't know how to read it, but I'll try. Hold on a second. Okay. It says, warning. I may, sp I may spotted, I may spottishly. Talk. What does it say? I can't read it. Talk about trains. I think it says. Yeah, talk about trains. I'm thinking I might wear are they all my train shirts on every day when I'm a real fan. So in case if I caught stepped out, wear the shirt. Or even ride a train. Yeah, those are my favorite shirts. They're, I believe they're all medium, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah. Now let me go get one of my missing presents I forgot downstairs, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, here are all the other gifts I also got that I forgot to bring. But let's have a look at them. First, I got new shoes. They look really nice. I need to have an upgrade shoes because my old shoes are gone and worn out, so they look brand new. I think they're leather. I'm not completely sure. But I need might be really good for walking, real fanning, and other good stuff. I just need to get used to it. So, men's, it's on, this size is men's eight. This is for the company. Yeah, it's a company. So, yeah. Up next is my another railroad crossing toy. This one is a 
a little, that says a little switch that you turn it on. Just like that, and it has a little outlet plug. You just plug it in. The only issue with this one is the red light works, but the green light is fried when I got it. And come on, it's brand new. How is it fried? I guess my mom got it on eBay, or maybe, I don't know, maybe it came out like that, but... I'm planning, planning to get another red bulb because it's not supposed to be green. It's supposed to be, like, red. So, yeah. The next one I also have is a yes button. I already have the no button. I already have, I need to have the yes button. So, every time I like it, I have to go, no, I have to go to school again. I press the yes button. Like, watch this. Hey, button. Do you want me to stay home all day and play Xbox Live? <laughs> so, she said yes. She probably didn't hear her that well. She said, yeah. So, let's listen to that again. I press it again. Yes, yes, yes. Yep, that's it. So, so those are all the gifts I got from my father's house. See, the mother stuff are one of my mother Christmas gifts are downstairs. So, one of my grandparents is probably my grandparents is going to. I guess also going to bring gifts too. So I guess I have to wait for them, and I'll make another. And I'll maybe be back when my other gifts come. So for my grandparents, so I'll be back shortly. Okay, guys. So these are all the gifts that I got from my grandparents, and I have a look at them. So let's have a look at them. The first gift I got is another Apple laptop. And I don't really know what this one is. This is a 2010 MacBook Pro. As you can see, it works. It's, it's like almost fully charged. When I turned it on and everything, I had like a user account. I don't know the password. As you can see, I can see it says MacBook Pro. Now I have like three Macs in my collection. I have an old 2008 or 2007 MacBook, original, there's a 2007 MacBook or 2008 MacBook that's in my, um, inside of the shelf, the wooden closet. Then I have a tw late 2010 MacBook Air. Now I have a 2010 MacBook Pro that the keyboard lights up. So if I try turning it on, I had a user account, so I'm going to turn it on, so... Because I'm going to show you what I mean, because... I didn't hear the disk, the disk drive, and you can see the Apple logo. I might need to reset it, because I had a user account. I guess this was from Best Buy, and I had a user account. So... While we wait for this to boot up, let's move on to one of my next gifts I got. This is from a card, and a, a nice Christmas card, and I actually got two 25 Roblox gift cards. I'm gonna buy use Rob. I'm gonna use it all with Robux. Actually, they're not scratched off, and I am not gonna give you guys the code, or else you're gonna go redeem it, and I'll be really upset. So I'm not gonna be giving. I am never giving y'all the code, as you can see. Discover millions of worlds. Um, which is really neat. And sometimes it'll include a free virtual item when you redeem it. Um, yeah, because I might use it. I might spend all my Robux to use it in on ultimate driving, so I can buy a new car. It just looks really nice. So, so I'm not. I'm never going to give you guys the code. So, be careful what you do. Never show your code on videos because or else people are going to go redeem it and never do that. So yeah, now I can share my MacBook Pro, just let, oh, boot it up. Alright guys, here is my MacBook Pro that's booted up. I just want to see the keyboard does light up. Probably won't see it that well, but you can see the lights. I just want to see it when I got it, it was at 77% and it does have a user password. It doesn't give me a password hit or anything. See, it doesn't give me like a hint. See, it doesn't give me a hint or anything. Watch, I'm hitting the enter key. Like on some Macs, it'll give you like a hint. See, it doesn't give me a hint. If I don't, I don't know what the password of how I'm going to log on. If I, yeah, guys, I am planning to get, I might reset it or maybe downgrade it. I'm not sure. I might reset it to its original, um, not original firmware, the latest version. Do you not know on Macs you can make the cursor big? Yeah, you can do that. The same thing with my MacBook Air. My MacBook Air does that too. See, look, this is the same thing on any MacBook. Like, it, it does it to my MacBook Air, too, so. So, yeah. 
I like how it glow on the Apple logo. That's nice. Anyways, let me put this to the side carefully. Now let's move on to my last gift. Last but not least in my Christmas presents, this is a nice, nice farm jug. As you can see, there's the, the barn and there's a horse. Back in the early, early, early days, we didn't have cars back in the day. We had to ride horses. As you can see, look at the old style. Yeah, they had a horse. See? There's the other farm. There's a silo. And this is another barn from... It has my name on it. This, I think this was from Lansaster County, PA. Well, that's very nice. Thank you, my grandfather, for giving me this jug. It looks very really nice. Actually, inside there's another horse and the weird looking vehicle passengers driver side this looks really nice i wonder if i can drink water or coffee i haven't had coffee in a while and i'm getting a low battery message and i'm gonna hurry up as you can see what was his year date um um it doesn't tell me a date or anything i guess they had no date so yeah that's pretty nice thank you for giving me this job my grandparents you're very nice and i think this looks like a nice Christmas gift. I want to say thank you so much. Anyways, let's put it back on the side and yeah. So yeah, guys, that is all the Christmas presents I got for Christmas. Let me know in the comments what you got for Christmas and I'll make sure to reply back as soon as I can. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching and Merry Christmas.